welcome to Friendships and Benefits. Today I'm with my friend Craig and it's Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving. And Craig and I have known each other since 2001 and have been spending our Thanksgivings together. We actually met at a Thanksgiving dinner. So Craig, what are you teaching me today? Today we're going to learn how to carve a turkey. Okay, I definitely have no experience in this because I'm usually drinking and eating and gossiping I've while noticed. you're in the corner carving the turkey for the last I've 10 noticed. years. So I'm ready to learn. Let's do it. So here's the here's here's kind of the strategy okay. and then we'll kind of go. The go key, I like to get all the dark meat off first. Okay. Legs, wings, get it out of the way, get it on the plate. Got it. That's the get it out of the way. Then we're going to take the skin off, uh -huh. we're going to carve it up, and we're going to put it on a baking sheet, drop it in the oven and get it nice and crispy. Great. Once the skin's gone, then we're going to remove the whole breasts, uh -huh. take them off, carve them up, serve it, get the skin out, wrap it all up in one plate. I'm ready. Now what materials do we need for this whole process? So we have a Cuisinart electric knife. Great. I've actually never used it. But all right. Oh wow. Working pretty all right. Good. Let's hope no one loses a finger. We have a regular, I don't know, Henkel or some sort of fancy knife. All right. We'll stop. Some nice knife. And we got a fork. Great. Basic, basic stuff. Let's do it. So let's um, let's start with the electric. Let's get all the dark meat off okay. first. See how the turkey's cooked. Seems a little stiff. Okay, and this turkey is 20 pounds, yeah, so 20. and it was cooked by Ronnie Siegel, who hosts our Thanksgiving every year and is amazing. She's a fabulous cook and host. Oh man, you're really going at it. Sometimes you got to use a little more than the knife, a little, right. a little bit of manpower. See, nice. What about woman power? Can I try? Same difference, sure. Okay. Stand back. Should I wear an apron? So what you want to do? You can. Okay. Now do the manly part and just kind of rip it off. All right, womanly part. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh. All right. That was Success. Pretty good. All right. All right, let's get this wing off. Okay, you just tear it off. Yeah. We don't really need the knife for this. Okay. We'll plate this much nicer when we're done. Right. Kind of getting out of the way. It's not about presentation now. It's about getting get this bird. Off. All right, now let's get the skin off, cut it up, get it on All that right, plate. All right, so how do you get the skin off? You just peel it? I'm just going to peel it. Maybe use this knife a little bit to get okay. it started. You know, just to kind of peel it up a little bit. This doesn't have to be fancy. This is just oh, coming yeah. off. Comes right off the bird. No idea that this is how you did this, so this is all good. I'll help you. And again, there's no magic to this. I'm going to just kind of get them into a couple inch pieces. All right. Favorite part. Definitely not the healthy part of things. No. Too, but this stuff is good. It's delicious. Like a potato chip, but of, uh, of meat. turkey skin. See some of this stuff here? This stuff's nasty. Get it just off. Kind of skin that off and get rid of that. All right. That works. Some nasty stuff. Who taught you how to carve a turkey? <laughs> I think you're probably watching too many of the TV food shows. Really? And then my uncle did it one year after uh -huh. I watched it, so... Then you uncle knew. Uncle Steven, I guess I'll give you a plug. Alright, that's nice. Thanks, Uncle Steven. This is good. I think you're I enlightening know. a lot I, of I people. Think, I think you ought to taste a piece. Really? I'm a vegetarian on normal days, but it's Thanksgiving, so here I go. <laughs> I'm, I'm, mm. I'm not, but I won't be a hypocrite either. <laughs> Yeah, it's good. Just kind of throw it on nice. there, nice fancy. Great. And pop it in the oven. How? What temperature? I don't know. I'm not good at that stuff. 350, 400. Whatever. It really matters. Okay. You can broil it. There's like four other things in there. I so. know. It's truly Thanksgiving. I think you're gonna have to. Yeah, right on top. There we go. All right. All right. This is really the magic. This is this is where the skill comes in. Okay. So essentially, what we want to do is we want to get the whole breast off. Uh huh. And then we want to slice it against the grain. Against the grain. I don't think the electric works really well here. Okay. So I'm going to go with go kind for of the old fashioned. I'm just kind of feeling for where the bone is. Uh huh. I'm running the knife down. Okay. As close to it as I can. Great. I'm trying to get it all the way through. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn the bird around, cut it on this side. Got it. All right. And if done right, this whole thing should come off. It's a big if. I think you're doing right. Let's see. Yeah, Craig. Look at that. A little bit of bone caught here. Yeah, just get it off. Okay. Great. 
It's a 20 pound turkey, so it's a pretty large uh, yeah. piece. We've got a little left here we can get as well. Beautiful. So now I'm we carve it, we're going to turn it this way. I'm going to slice it just like this. Okay. Thinner is better. Right. Oh, you do it with the electric knife? Yeah, the hand we're going to with the electric All right. Can I try to slice some? Okay, here I go. How's that? Great. Yeah, it's the best. You need like a half an inch, probably. I think probably like a quarter. All right. Oh, that's good. That's all good. It's all right. good. Watch those fingers. All right, so now what we want to do, you can use a spatula, we can uh -huh. kind of just go quick with this. I'm going to turn the plate this way. I get this over here. I'm going to kind of just scoop this up. Got it. And lay it down like that. Nice. And now we're going to do the same thing with the second one. Great. You want to try getting it off? Yeah. All right, so get as close to the bone, cut down. Put your fingers. Wait, is, okay, I think I got it, yeah. There you go. Okay, so at the bone. Yes. And then you want to come around on the back side here, kind of uh -huh. make an incision all the way down. It's like surgery. Yeah, oh, I'll good. hold the pan. Okay. No. Come get through there, yep. Yeah. And now just kind of do one more cut and hopefully we can pull it right off. Okay. Okay, let's see if we can cut pull pull it off. Pull that thing out of the way for you. Oh, I didn't cut to the bone. Hold on. <laughs> Let's see how you did. What do you think? I think pretty good. Pretty good. All good. right, pretty good yeah. for a first timer. Pretty damn good, not bad. Actually, much much better than not bad. All right. So again, Sweet. we'll clean that up at the end. Right. We want to just get this nice and thin. The ends tend to be a little drier, which is right. light flakes. The dogs don't like the electric knife. Right. Can you show Lulu? Lulu. Electric knives and kids from Peabody, they go well together. Apparently. I think you can say the same for Canton. All right, looking All right, good, so Craig. Nice and even. This should come up pretty easily. Nice and easy. Oh, that one was way better. Nice. Yeah, learning curve. Yeah, totally. Okay. Through, but right. you can either use the electric or the non-electric. Let's try the electric just to okay. up a little. And believe it or not, sometimes when you cut it this way versus taking the breast off, yeah. the other way it has a little bit of a different taste. Oh, so interesting. We'll leave some of it this way for the people who may like that. Right. Yeah, that's pretty much All it, right, though. Cool. That's, that's how to carve a turkey. Great. Okay, well, here is that our finished that was fun. version. Yeah, it was, yeah, it was great. Fun. Actually came out really well. It looks no beautiful, obviously, and the table looks amazing, thanks to Ronnie. Um, so, Craig, what are you grateful for this year for Thanksgiving? Uh, this is a good year. My lovely twins. Yep, my he's new a home, new dad and a new homeowner. My wife, and I have natural gas in my house. Woo! All right. Just in time for the winter. And I'm grateful for all of my family and friends and my wonderful life as well. So, awesome. Very grateful. Happy Thanksgiving, and thanks for watching Friendships with Benefits. Peace.